All righty. Ladies and gentlemen, what's up? How are you doing? Good to see you. Welcome back to Silly Goose Gaming. We got big news, ladies and gentlemen. Risk of Rain True, uh, Seekers of the Storm Dev Diary number two just dropped a three minute and 55 second video. I'm excited. So this is my first reaction. I haven't watched it yet. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna like, do all this. I'm not gonna spoil. I'm gonna spoil something. I'm not gonna spoil anything for myself or you guys. We're gonna walk in this together, and uh, we're gonna see what happens. So without further ado, here we go. Let's get this full screen here. Time to go. So here we go. Uh, Dev Diary number two. The stages. Talk about the stages, which is so much. It's it's awesome. Uh, I'm I'm pretty excited for this guys. I don't know what's gonna happen. I don't know what's gonna be included in this video But I'm excited and that's what matters. Before, so uh, let's I'm see. Bruno and today I'm going to serve as your tour guide through some of the treacherous oh stages coming with our new expansion Seekers of the Storm But first we have a bit of a surprise We've been eager to share with you the team has been working hard on a new content update This update brings a new stage a suspiciously familiar looking skin that's a skin or is that, uh, is, that a, is that a person? And two new artifacts. If you've ever dreamed of raising your own Lemurian army, then this is the update you've been waiting for. Seriously, just so many Lemurians. It's coming soon for everyone. Yes, everyone. We're excited for you to give it a swing. For those of you intrepid enough to stick around, let's continue our safari. I'm gonna stop there. We're gonna walk back through that one more time because holy crap, holy crap. Devotion update two. Content Here on update. Risk of two. It's this content update. upgrade. Content update. Uh, new stage. Brings a new stage. New stage. Okay. Uh, Verdant Falls. Suspiciously. What? The prisoner, which is a skin for the mercenary, which is cool. Your looking skin. Keep adding skins, please. And two new artifacts. Delusion, which looks like this chest. If you've ever dreamed of raising. The chest has to be purchased twice, maybe. Your own Lemurian army. And then the artifact of devotion. Then this is the update you've been waiting for. Spawns in Seriously, Lemurians. Just so many. That Lemurians. will be so much fun. It's coming soon for everyone. Yes, everyone. Everyone. That's good news. We're excited for you to give it a swing. What was that? Yes, everyone. We're excited for you to give it a swing. What is this? Gold? Was this like Lucky Charms? For those of you. Is this an April Fool's joke? Oh, I hope not. Are you intrepid enough to stick around? Let's continue our story. Gup. In Secrets of the Storm, we're introduced to a false savior, a creature born of desperation and corrupted by ambition. Now, the false sun gathers his storm atop a colossal statue built in the image of Providence. Hmm. Travel the path of the Colossus through a series of stages. Those who survive and make their way to the top can take on Petricor's most threatening challenge. There will be a few ways to start down the path of the Colossus. Okay. But even just setting off on this trek can spell. Whoa! Death. What is that? That's gonna be so annoying to fight. Oh, I'm so excited. Take a second to consider if you're up for it. But despite the ever-present danger of Petrol Five, there has always been a beauty to it. We wanted to open up new sure. areas that capture even more of that magic. With new terrain, lush foliage crumbling structures That's each cool. environment offers a fresh take on the classic risk of rain you know and love let's head somewhere new hmm this crater seems a bit foreboding to me uh -uh. as if there were some sort of catastrophic spike themed explosion that happened well that might be a story for another day what welcome to the shattered abode shattered abode the Miriams that once called this place home appear to be long gone all that's left behind is a crumbled husk of their former metropolis. The abodes provide a clean line of sight across the central crater. That's so cool. A certain cool. railgun wielding survivor would adore taking fights from the high ground. That's to good. Team. Railgun map W. What is that? A baby? I can see that baby over there. There's two. But the clear line of sight cuts both ways. You'll find that some high damage early bosses are particularly challenging to evade. Survivors will need to carefully mm. plan their paths through the depression. okay this is a kind of a cool map it's a win win uh, it's a win loss situation don't be stuck in the open against stone titans you will die in architecture to avoid being eviscerated by a rogue wandering vagrant or a dubiously accurate stone titan 
dubiously. Wait a All second. Right. I think I see a familiar, albeit terrifying face. There it is. Yep. Okay, cool. Some fans will know this next one. Introducing Child. Child. Don't be disarmed by his playful disposition and frolicking skip. This ghostly creature brings nothing but doom. It's a the range. teleporting bundle of death is somehow it every teleports. bit as dangerous as the rest of its family, despite being a fraction of the size. Now that we've gotten away from that's that gonna be mad. I'm gonna be so mad at we that. We can look at another neat feature coming with Seekers of the Storm. For a long time, looping your run hasn't given you much more to look at. Well, apart from these adorable porters, that's scavenger. We wanted to make that experience a little more special with the expansion. Players who are bold enough to loop will be greeted by some unfamiliar stage variants. These will certainly spice up the look of those stages, but the changes go beyond that. Often, you'll find new passages are available that were previously caved in. We don't want to spoil all of that right now. That's Gotta sick. Leave some places to explore. It's true. But hopefully, this will make the prospect of looping even more exciting. As we come closer to having a launch date, we'll dive back in with more information about new survivors. If you're feeling excited, Make sure to head over to Steam and wishlist Seekers of the Storm. Bye for now. New survivors with an S. Multiple survivors. They probably already said that. All right, let's read through this and now and take a look. Because uh, it, it will go over the stuff, again, that was said in the video. So here we go. Hello, everyone. Today, we're looking at some of the new stages in the upcoming expansion, Seekers of the Storm. Seekers of the Storm allows players to explore some of the lost regions, by bringing six new stages across ancient Lumerian temples to intense showdowns on a redacted uh, planet? I don't know. Uh, with plenty of secrets to uncover. Uh, pector... Pec... 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 Perictor... Pec... Uh, this one, V, is a wild and beautiful world. Um, and we wanted to open up new unexplored areas to players and capture the sheer beauty inherited from the expansive... Risk of Rain. Universe, New Terrain, Lost Foliage, yada, yada, yada. Okay, cool. So, uh, new maps. Very cool. Looks looks fun to me. I'm excited. Um, Shattered Abodes is Tier 1 stage. Okay. This would be this would be fun. Um, I don't know, dude. Maybe they're like going to improve the tracking, but they don't... I don't know, man. Um, Alright, so we got survivors like Railgunner, Huntress, Voidfiend, Acrid, and Redacted. So, one of the new... Uh, survivors mentioned here can utilize their high vertical mobility to move between um, stages uh, tier systems with ease mm. so who is redacted someone with vertical movement maybe a jetpack user no we already have that what am I saying uh, I don't know that'll be that'll be cool to know cool to, cool to know why is why is railgunner huntress void fiend and acrid on here not not the others with vertical. Okay, whatever. Looks cool though. Uh, talk about the new the new holes in the ground. That looks fun. Um, okay, new variants t uh, for you to explore the map differently. That'd be fun. Okay, that'd be that'd be good. That'd be cool. And there's the new event or the new updated skin, which looks pretty sick to me. Uh, now, is this different than the last one? I don't think so. Uh, but this is a free update, which is very cool to me. Good, good update coming soon. I like that a lot. And this is talking about the Devotion update. So, just that ad we watched earlier. Looks fun to me. Uh, yeah, I'm super excited. Look at that. Why? Does he always look like that? Maybe I'm tripping. I don't know. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I'm super excited for this. If you are, make sure to head over to Steam and wishlist it. Push this in the top. Uh, because that'll let, us, that'll let them know that we're interested. And so, maybe it'll make them... Release update faster. I don't know. Just guessing here. But ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching this video. If you guys have any ideas of what's going to happen in this DLC from the trailer, any things that I missed, let me know down in the comment section below. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks all. Love you all. Bye-bye.